So we got up at 5 this morning to load all our bags into the car. Um, drove from Lalo Manu. Um, we went to the market this morning, like the food market, to get some breakfast. So we got some for like a more and some pancakes, and it was so good. Um, so yeah, so got all the people here waiting for the ferry. Um, and hopefully no motion sickness. So I do have, the last time I was on the ferry I got real sick so I bought some motion sickness tablets. Hopefully that helps. So yeah, we'll see you guys on the ferry. So we're on the ferry now and uh, there are no seats. So we're standing, but just as long as my mother and father-in-law have a seat, then I'm happy. So they're just sitting right there. That's my son, Leah. So they got a seat, but that's the rest of the family there. Yeah. Yeah. There's nothing left. <laughs> and uh, we got Rose over there. <laughs> and then we got Tima and Daniel on this side. So yeah, just took my tablets. Um, yeah, so hopefully you don't get sick because we still have the rest of the day to spend in Samai. Um, so the process of getting on the ferry was a bit stressful. Um, so everyone was just like pushing and shoving in the, in the queue. So um, because there was 19 of us and the kids, it was, they just need a better system of boarding um, all the people onto the ferry, so that was quite stressful. Um, there's a lot of people like cutting through the queues um, and just being inconsiderate. Uh, so it's about, uh, I think it's just over an hour on the ferry to get to Savai. Um, and we are on, so I think there's two different types of ferries. So there's a larger one and there's a smaller one. So we, this is the smaller one. This, this is the bigger one, so we're on the bigger one. And what do you know what this one's called? Uh, so we're on Lady Samoa Ferry, so we're on the big one actually, not the small one. Um, so I'm actually surprised because it's the big one, but um, there's still not enough seats. So we're on the top, top, on the highest level, um, sitting uh, outside. So I thought would sit outside because I think the breeze will just help if, if we do get sick or if my kids get sick. So, so yeah, but as you can see, it's a full house. Yeah. All right.
back in Sabai yesterday afternoon. So I didn't get to vlog yesterday because by the time we got back, we were so tired um, just from the ferry ride. And then just like getting the taxi to where we are was like, so my husband's like, they were nearly died because they nearly crashed into a van because the taxi was too busy. Like the driver was too busy talking to the other guy in the van and it was still going. They almost crashed into another van. So yeah, so it was pretty hectic yesterday. Um, we all had afternoon naps. Um, just went for a small evening walk down to the local supermarket um, with the kids. Um, had dinner and then we pretty much just went to sleep after that. So today is a new day. So everyone is just getting ready now uh, to head off to the market. So I think we're catching a bus with everyone to the market. So that'd be cool for the kids to experience um, the bus ride. And what do we have for breakfast this morning? So my mother-in-law made us guapo lesa this morning. We got fresh bread. The fresh bread in Samoa is so good. You gotta have it with like heaps and heaps of butter, like the block butter. So yeah, so we are now getting ready to leave um, and head off to the market. So we'll see you guys there. Makeki, Makeki, Choli, Makeki, Makeki, no one cares. Hello, hey Tima, it's an energetic. <laughs> I guess we'll touch on the house a bit later on. But this is the old man's uh, laundromat. <laughs> Got nice two little fillers here as well. To chew. So we got fish, my sister's son or dog. Is it? And we got brownie here, which is my mum and dad's other son. And that's brownie's fale. We're not allowed to sit there because he gets angry. So we're just on the main road of uh, Salilonga. Uh, so just to the left is the Western Union. Oh, Western Union. Point to the left is um, there's the wharf from Mulifangua. to the villages from the lights left and right. Also Western Union just across the road. So these are one of those dogs in Samoa that freaking follow the the cars, get hit by the cars and that. His mum. Not very friendly. <laughs> Not very friendly this morning, guys. Guys excited? For a bussy or what? Iron Tilly, what's the Iron Man, please? Iron Man. Oh. We're waiting for the white one. I think it just goes to Sakanga Loa, comes back. The white one? Or any it's bus? Ah, mum. Bus Palang. Bus Palang. 
What if the Samoan comes first? If the Samoan comes, man, we'll just go on that, hey. <laughs> what book have you got there? The Samoan Handbook. How are you finding it? I haven't even read it properly. Wow. Wow. That's useful. Fish. Some of the um some of the drivers here bro are uh, mighty yeah, Go 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 go. Good done. Hello. So we're very lucky. <laughs> so heading to the Makeki. I mentioned earlier, just straight down uh, towards the wharf. A bit of a turn off, and then we're at the Makeki. So not Doing like all over Samoa, same over here in Savai, um, a lot of singers are uh, taking over. So, heaps of shops, leasing a lot of uh, locals' properties as well. Lingi, go off Nana, you too. Grab the shopping. So, hello baby, so Taro, Welcome you... to Salerolona Market. <laughs> How much was the kalo? <laughs> Do you like it though? Do you like eating kalo? Alright, alright. Six and five. Oh, nice carvings as well. Lingi. You're like, no, mine's better. I'm not doing it. You like that?
it's a lot about these at the STA. Someone tours in whatever, which was um, very informing. It was pretty cool. I think Salong is just a little bit more expensive than Apia um, from a lay market here. <coughs> Turn black like yellow lovers. The norm um, in Apia is 10 tala. Over here is. Um, over here is 15 tala. The basic is. And while we're walking around, even though you sort of just ate, you can smell some food going on and I'm starving. Making me hungry. Anything catching your eye? No, not really. But it's a lot smaller, eh, than um I went to two ads about uh Ear Love Love and it was twenty two tall. Oh wow. I was saying earlier, it's just a little bit more expensive here. Yeah, just a little bit more expensive than our beer. Than our beer. Nice barber shop here. Haircut? Hmm? Haircut? Ah, uh, no thanks. <laughs> <laughs> it's very beautiful. You're so sad. <laughs> It's uh, Kentucky. <laughs> DMC is... It's uh, K like a KFC. Yeah, where is it? It's near the wharf. You know when we got off the ferry? Oh. Right there. Did you not smell it? I so when it. I hopped off the ferry, I felt so sick and I was tired. Like when I smelled the DMC. <laughs> <laughs> Are you a foodie or what? Do you like? Yeah. I, I guess I am. The kids could probably count as one too. So we're just... So mum was just asking um, like if we've had enough like looking around in that at the market here. And I was just like... So coming from like our beer market to Salonga market is like like asking Driving back from Perth after a weekend there, doing shopping, going back to Kalgoorlie and um, not having a shopping mall, you know, just the usual Kmart stuff. Where are we off to now? I just thought you need to go and ask if there's a tattoo shop around here. Oh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Get it done. Yeah? Today. Let's get it over and done, done with. So we can relax on our last day at the Tony you know, We don't have to do any running around. Just asking if there's a tattoo shop. So I'm assuming, guys, this is where they do oh, the fish. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just looks similar to the one in um in Arpia. I don't know what day they have the fish market there. Probably Should be Sunday. Sunday morning early. So I have to check it out. Check it out after a night of clubbing and selling alongers, eh? Kelly, I'll clap for you. The clap club X. I'm a Lacy. Malay club Y. Malay Malay Oasis. Hey. Malay club P. Are you mocking? <laughs> Are you mocking? <laughs> Sad. So I was getting ready to spend some money at the market, but it was nowhere to spend the money. <laughs> Sad. No, it's good. It's more like. They don't have much variety of like um, the handcrafted souvenirs and things like that. It's more like um, household items. So like hairbrushes, gels, um, coffee mugs, like stuff like that they have at this market. Um, but I know there's an Ebendi and a Tanoa here, so we might have a look at that. 
um, Lua's just gone to the lotto shop and hopefully we go to DMC for lunch after here. Hopefully. Oh, everyone's with us except for the old man? Yep, and Notima. Our tour guide didn't come with us, so we don't know exactly where to go. Short trip, short trip to Salerlonga Market. So good. So what did we get today? So what did you like your market? It's alright. Yeah, it's pretty, um, it's good, basic. You don't have to spend a whole day here. <laughs> oh, we got salo. Alright, that's for our cookouts and all. Cucumbers. Oh, that's God good. damn. Who's Siapo? Lua and Ili. Oh, it's, it's some Siapo. You want to show us your Siapo? Do it with a smile, please. So these are nice. These are ah, nice to bring. Yes. How much were they, Bray? I think they're all 30. How much? 30. 30. Each. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Yeah, these are nice to um, frame. Nice. Well done, Brayden. Liev, anything your parents get you? <laughs> he was looking for a bracelet, but he couldn't find one. Yes. I was going to ask to sit on yours. Yeah, you can sit on mine. So Alex got an ice cream and now mom's eating it. Okay. Johnny's is all later. Uncle Johnny. You don't like it? Can I have my It's not top top. So yeah, we've got the first lot of meals. Right. So we're just here at DMC. We've yeah, got fried chicken. chicken, chips and soft drinks. How's the chicken? How's the seasoning? Good? Crunchy on the outside. Mm, just how it should be. <laughs> Not there. What do we have here? Double cheeseburger. We'll get some of these after. Kids don't want to be recorded eating. Your bucket's coming. Do you have a bucket? And I've got a double beef and uh, baby chips. Oh, sorry. It's a medium. Medium. <laughs> and to help yourself. And to help yourself. <laughs> Oh cool as you guys have to finish it. You guys have to finish it. Alright, later camera. What are we talking about? That you and your brother have a fifty percent chance. What's wrong with bold? It's a style. Let's walk. DMCs. Burgers I didn't like. I didn't like. The kids liked them. But the chicken. Mate. Chicken is definitely uh, over eight. Over eight. How did you like it? It was. It was good. It's good. I probably won't go back again, but at least I've tried it. Yeah. Cool. Yeah, nice. Good. Really big servings there. Yeah. Right? Yeah. It's like chickens on steroids or something. Yeah. Chicken. I'll show you the first one. Are we walking back? Is there anyone here? How are you going to exercise so, and walk it off? Yeah. No. Let's actually, we got really two mean. double beef burger combos, which were 27 tala each. Mean. Two double oh, cheese okay. combos, yes, which was 25 tala each. And we got a happy chicken bucket. So that came with two large fries and 10 pieces of chicken in the bucket for 53 tala. That's, that's right. So it was 157 tala Damn. altogether. That's pretty. I think, uh, what you get that from? From Melbourne. Oh, you like Alright, let's go. Cool. Uh -huh. I got it with the 
So the agreement was to walk back to uh, mum and dad's house. Um, I think these guys are gonna try and catch a bus. We we'll called a taxi from the Nakiki to DMC. We'll just keep walking. Yeah, beautiful. Thank you. Thank you, DMC. Just run it up. Looks like we are, baby. Single file. <laughs> Lincoln, off the phone. So everyone's good, eh? Burn it off, eh? Oh yeah, okay, okay. Sorry, we'll see ya. Faster, faster! Tentala. Harbour side. I feel like my accent's changing. Harbour side. I don't know why I'm saying. I don't even know why I'm talking like this. Ah. What do you say? I will let the tourist information. Come on, there. What do you say? He said Harbour side. Okay, you know, you know. Lisa. Hee hee. So le hard out. The Uso. Hello. Got some uh, some friends walking with us. Locals. I don't think we've walked a K yet. I think we've only walked about. I swear, man. It's been like maybe 500 meters at most. Then gone, man. Just want to rip off my clothes and. Just feel the breeze, you know? Sure. Take it up. No, it's okay, darling. <laughs> Just in case they're like, tell it the rock, you know? The rock's here, you know what I'm saying? Mm. <laughs> How's your walk going? <laughs> yeah, Pika gets a bit like this after eating and that. When she gets tired, it's like you can't get anything out of her, you know? Dins Hair Beauty Salon. Very cool. Louis Restaurant and Barbecue. Oh, oh, that's a good yeah. Hello. 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 Because there's RTV just up there. <laughs> 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 so cool as the shops are more for you guys that don't know. So the <coughs> obviously the like the bigger grocery stores are 
I like saying I earned in that, saying I run. Um, these are like, like the milk bar, the milk bars, the OGs eh, of the Samoan shops. Eh? So support local guys, support local. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's go. See what? It's easy to fuck Valera, this girl, you know. <laughs> That's the RTV Becca was talking about. What day does Western Union get busy? Probably Thursdays because that's where. Isn't that when Australia gets all their pensions and everything? <sighs> Well, shout out to the families that what do you call it they keep providing for for the families they have here in Samoa Western Union we use the moneygram I think the the fees are cheaper moneygram rather than the Western Union Kangelu, uh, one of our older cousins that lives here. The taxi. Fucking home sweet home, mate. Wish. Flea bags, but they're still loved. <laughs> Any more loads today? I do a tour of the house. Wait, so kitchen? This is the kitchen, we have the fridge. Ah, yeah, yeah. Ah, See, got to have coffee. Nice. We have bedroom one. We have an air conditioner. That's my room. This is not Timman's room. Everyone's just relaxing from our walk. Do you know what? Right. We had to walk off the thing. This is my room, my husband. <laughs> um, we have an aircon as well. But yeah, this is my mother and father's room. So they let us stay in their room. So we're very lucky to have aircon. Until have Thursday night, yep. Bathroom, one with a toilet. I think someone's in there. I'm in here. Okay. <laughs> Saz is in there. This is the third bedroom. This is where all the boys are sleeping. So we just put. Um, Mattresses on the floor, and they've got a fan going in there, and then they use the open shower and toilet at the back here. Hello, 
this is the back area. <coughs> this is just where we hang our washing. So this is the back of the valley. Washing room. That's next door's property. There. All right, so we'll go around. So this is um, my father-in-law's cousin. She lives behind here. Knows more than me. So he used to he used to have a car wash which used to be here. Um but because we extended the back, um he doesn't do the car wash anymore. So he used to go all the way through. But because of the extension, uh, we don't have that space anymore. So we have two little fallows over here. Just for you know the customers to wait while they're waiting for their, their laundry to get done. And I've seen people sit here when they're waiting for the bus. So in front is a bus stop, but this isn't for the bus stop. So please, if you're using this for the bus stop, pay, uh, just pay your five tala to the laundry. Oh God. Okay. So yeah, that's where we are. Then on the side here is my father-in-law's other cousin. So she runs a, she has a bakery. So it's a bakery at the front. She does catering, like wedding cakes, and stuff like that for birthdays. So that's just next door. And so this is located right opposite the Western Union. So it's on the main road in San Luma. So if you're traveling and you need to get your laundry done, come and support my family's business and Darcy Laundromat. Kids, ready? Go for a swim? In the shower. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> what are you up to? <laughs> You. Uh, technically, it's n, 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 because we're like gangsters, bro. New. And if you're American, it's new. <laughs> so like, I had an American accent today. It was just like. <laughs> Harbour side, like it just came out of nowhere, you know what I'm saying? So we got some fries and some chicken. Are you doing an American accent? Yeah, yeah. You can't? <laughs> that's not. It's a southern that's fried just, chicken. That's just posh. Yo, and we like, look at all the um, the ockers up here mm -hmm. of the family and that. See all the photos yeah. of the family, of the Iyengar? Yeah. <laughs> so over there we have Alex, Lure. Well done, well done. All right, time to have a news. What happened? I'm so hot. <laughs> <laughs> right. All right. I just realized this is this will be too thingy for you. Okay. Is that fitted? Yeah, like a that's why boobs here, and then it goes out, but it's like long. You can try it if you want. <clears throat> Looks like we're playing dress up today. I don't think it's going to zip. So, everyone is just chilling. I'm going to see if Becca wants a skirt. No, no. That jersey I lost a bit. Origin, I had to... Sunday. Hey, oh, look, a yeah. six pack. Let's go. Do they sell dog food here in Samoa? Yeah, we've seen it at Frankie. How much is it expensive? Oh, so just to the viewers and that, we just, we make, we make do with what we have over here, I guess.
So how do you feel that the dogs eat before us? What a holiday is this? <laughs> Dogs first. <laughs> the dogs have finished eating. Now it's time to feed the kids. Thank you.